you want to add GoPro GPS data such as speedometer, distance, altitude and much more? Here is everything you need to know. Let's go! Hi and welcome to GoPro and Explore. If this is your first time here on this channel and you like everything about GoPro and other action camera related stuff, start now by subscribing, clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. With the GPS mode turned on on the GoPro, it can capture your speed, altitude, elevation gain, g-force and many other parameters. It's very easy to set up and you can use this from the GoPro Hero 5. All you have to do is turn on your GoPro camera, enter the main menu, select regional and turn on GPS mode. Now you're ready to get some cool shots and once again don't be afraid to think outside of the box here. So you got your amazing footage and you're ready to place the GoPro gauges in your video. How do you do this? Well, that's very simple. The only program you need for this is the GoPro app, which can be downloaded if you go to the official GoPro website. Download the application and when it's installed, you're ready to import your footage. Select your video, click on the edit button and you will enter the editing features. Select stickers and here you can find and add all the GPS parameters you want. Click again if you want to switch position as well. And that's it. Most important thing to know is that you need a GoPro app on your mobile for this. Now, there are quite a lot of discussions on the internet that people can't do this in the quick app in the desktop mode. Now, I've tried it as well on desktop and it told me that it couldn't find any GPS data in my video. In the GoPro app, it wasn't a problem and I could find those easily. The only inconvenience in the GoPro app is that you can't make your gauges larger, which you should be able to do in the quick app for desktop. Hopefully GoPro is still working on this as the GoPro Hero 9 is coming very soon. Also please note that it's not possible to import your footage directly to Premiere Pro for example and add the gauges over there. You need to go to the GoPro app first. Before ending up I need to quickly mention that the GoPro Hero 9 is on its way and I'll be doing quite a lot of videos and tutorials about this new camera. So stay tuned when the GoPro Hero 9 is released. So I hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial, if it was please leave a like, make sure to let me know in the comments if you have any trouble activating the gauges in your videos and don't forget to subscribe if you like anything about GoPro and action cam related stuff. I see you in the next video.